Welcome all to Fanciful Animal, where today we'll see that the deep sea is home to some of the most extreme creatures on Earth, but nothing compares to this little warrior. Meet the iron-skinned snail, also known as Chrysomalon squamiferum. This tiny mollusk looks like something out of science fiction, but it's 100% real. It's one of the only known animals on the planet that uses metal to build its own armor, turning itself into a living tank. Let's dive deep into the ocean and uncover the secrets of this ironclad survivor. The iron-skinned snail lives in one of the most hostile environments on Earth, hydrothermal vents, more than 2,400 meters below the ocean surface. These vents pump out scalding hot, mineral-rich water, creating an ecosystem unlike anything else. The pressure here is intense, the water is loaded with toxic chemicals, and yet somehow this snail not only survives, it thrives. And its secret? A shell unlike anything else in the animal kingdom. Most snail shells are made of calcium carbonate, but the iron-skinned snail takes things to a whole new level. Its shell has three distinct layers, each designed for survival. The outer layer is literally made of iron. That's right, this snail absorbs iron from its environment and fuses it into its shell, creating a natural coat of armor. Beneath the iron is a squishy, shock-absorbing layer, acting like a built-in cushion to absorb impacts from predators. And the final layer is a hardened base of aragonite, the same mineral found in other snail shells. This unique combination makes the iron-skinned snail one of the toughest animals on the planet, capable of withstanding attacks that would shatter an ordinary mollusk. Nature has literally turned this snail into a walking suit of armor, but how does this snail actually get iron into its shell? The answer lies in the toxic, mineral-rich water surrounding hydrothermal vents. As the snail moves across the vent ecosystem, it absorbs iron sulfide directly from the water and the rocky surfaces it clings to. Special proteins in its body help transport and deposit the iron into its shell, where it hardens into a protective layer. This process is completely unique in the animal kingdom. No other creature on Earth builds its body using metal like this. With all that armor, you might think the iron snail is a fierce predator. But in reality, it doesn't even need to eat the way most animals do. Instead, it has a secret weapon, bacteria. Inside its body, the snail hosts bacteria that feed on the toxic chemicals from the hydrothermal vents. These bacteria convert the chemicals into energy, providing the snail with all the nutrients it needs to survive. This process, known as chemosynthesis, allows life to thrive in a world completely cut off from sunlight. The iron-skinned snail isn't just armoured, it's an entire walking ecosystem. For a creature that seems built like a tank, the iron-skinned snail reproduces in a surprisingly delicate way. Like many deep-sea snails, it lays its eggs in clusters, attaching them to rocks near hydrothermal vents. Once hatched, these baby snails are tiny and fragile, lacking their protective iron shell. They spend their early life drifting in the deep sea currents before eventually settling near a hydrothermal vent, where they will begin absorbing iron from the environment and developing their signature armor. It's a slow and difficult journey, but those that survive grow into some of the toughest creatures in the deep ocean. As incredible as the iron-skinned snail is, its future is under threat. Hydrothermal vents are rich in valuable metals like copper and gold, making them prime targets for deep-sea mining. If these delicate ecosystems are destroyed, creatures like the iron snail could disappear before we even fully understand them. Scientists are racing to study these animals and conservationists are pushing for legal protections to prevent deep-sea mining from wiping them out. The iron-skinned snail is a living example of how life finds a way even in the most extreme environments. With its natural metal armor, symbiotic bacteria, and ability to survive in one of the harshest places on Earth, it's one of the most fascinating creatures in the deep sea. But will it survive human impact? That's a question we still have to answer. If you love deep sea mysteries and want to see more incredible creatures, hit that like button and subscribe for more amazing nature stories. Until next time on Fanciful Animal.